<laughs> Yo. First two games already. And Brooklyn destroy man, bro. And destroy the Warriors. Beat them. They didn't, even, they didn't even get a chance to score 100 points. Same thing with Boston. I know it was just the first two games, but damn, you know that this Brooklyn team is for real. Kyrie hitting threes left and right. Kevin Durant hitting threes left and right. I mean, damn. Kyrie scored like 30 plus points. Kevin Durant, I think it was like 29. Like, she. This is no joke. Karis LeVert and Jared Allen doing their thing coming off the bench. And you saw how they were operating. Like, pick and rolls was nice around the fourth quarter. And that's what gave them that little comfortable lead there. Gave Kyrie and Kevin Durant some breathing room. It's just a nice team. But the one concern that I have for this team, and just please, please put Spencer Dinwiddie on the bench. This is not a bad thing that I'm talking about. This is actually for good. Because this man... He always comes off the bench. You know, he always came off the bench as a sixth man. Always gave you like a good 15 points per game. Spencer Dinwiddie's that type of guy. He cannot play with two ball dominant players in Kyrie and Kevin Durant. It's just not gonna work. Just please, please put Spencer Dinwiddie on the bench with Karis Lavert. I think this would be a nice two, two combo guard. If they just, if Steve Nash can just do that, the way this team is just gonna work is just gonna be completely different. Then after that, you just put like what, like Laundry Shamit, like a, a shooter uh, to start. It's all good. They're gonna have another shooter coming in from the starting lineup. Spencer Dinwiddie's gonna go back to his regular production because man, I just saw this guy. This guy barely got the ball. And again, it's not like. As if it was Kevin Durant's fault or Kyrie Irving's fault. They were just hot. I mean, they were mad efficient. I cannot blame them. But how is Spencer Dinwiddie going to play if those two guys get hot? It's just not going to work. So I just think that you just put Spencer Dinwiddie on the bench. This guy will give you like a good 15 points, 12 points with Karis Levert. Off the bench. And this team is just going to be on a whole nother level, man. Whole nother level. I mean, I know I'm exaggerating. It's just the first two games. But, I mean, the way they're clicking right now, you know how it is. I mean, they're, of course, they're going to have some cold games here and there. But it's just a question of just the way this team is just constructed. Oh, I have some pretty good hopes. Again, just Steve Nash, please put Spencer Dinwiddie on the bench. <sighs> That's all that needs to be said here. Just please, yo, fellas, put the prayers. All right, prayers up for Spencer Dinwiddie to come off the bench because this team, I'm telling y'all, it can make some noise. <laughs>